Good evening. Thanks for staying up with us tonight. We're going to begin this evening with breaking news of a standoff. Toledo police just wrapping up a situation on the corner of South and Langdon. Our reporter on the scene is 13 ABC Senna Ora. Senna? Well, after more than two hours on the scene here, Toledo police and the SWAT unit have ended the standoff with no result. Now, after many attempts of communication, failed communications, the SWAT unit forced their way into the home about 20 minutes ago and found no signs of the victim or the suspect. Now, we were talking about this home, the second home right behind the stop and go here. Officers tell me they were dispatched to this area after reports of a man forcing a woman at knife point inside the house. We are told that this stems from a domestic situation between between a boyfriend and girlfriend. We're told the couple also have kids together. Now, nearby neighbors who had to be evacuated told us it all began at the corner here near the stop and go. They said the couple were arguing when everything escalated pretty quick. Here's the latest from police. Uh, we had a situation, domestic situation. We had a female that was allegedly being hit by a male. Another witness, bystander, saw it, tried to intervene. At that point, the male, I guess, pulled a knife on the girl and drug her in the house over there that's behind us. And well, you made entry. What happened once uh, SWAT crews made entry into the home? Well, we tried to establish line of communication. That all failed. SWAT team uh, entered the house, and no one was in the house. So we do know from previous findings that we did find that the children were at Grandma's house, so we knew kids weren't in the house. But we're still trying to locate the victim at this time and the suspect. Altercation was caught on security camera, and officers have reviewed that tape. Right now, they are continuing to investigate, and right now, there is no word on where that suspect or that victim might be. And of course, we'll stay on top of this story and follow it as it develops. Reporting live in Toledo, I'm Senna Ora. Bill, back to you. And a thank you. Well, several.